Hi, I'm Lata. I'm from Informatica Support Team. In this presentation, I'll be talking about monitoring tool and hang scenarios. This is the brief agenda. I will be talking about uh, monitoring service architecture, monitoring configuration, and monitoring features. Also, we'll talk about why monitoring tool hangs, the diagnostics to be collected, and troubleshoot this issue, few known issues to be aware of, recommended configuration, and references. Monitoring service is one of the domain functionality managed by ISP where we configure MRS as monitoring repository to store, persist, update as well as retrieve runtime statistics about the uh, job executed by multiple data integration servers. It is recommended that we should not be using the same MRS uh, for storing monitoring statistics as well as the design time or runtime objects. After we configure the model repository service at the domain level in the admin console, we can view the monitoring statistics in the monitoring tool. The configured monitoring MRS stores the statistics and reports for the multiple data integration servers and the job executed by these uh, data integration servers. This is the brief monitoring architecture. When a user submits the job, data integration service contact monitoring MRS to persist the statistics about the running job. It keep updating the statistics about this job into the monitoring MRS. The client like admin console contacts the monitoring MRS, which is the information about these statistics and the monitoring tool displays it. Let's talk about monitoring configuration. To view job statistics and reports, user must configure monitoring for the domain. By default, monitoring MRS is not configured at the domain level. User has to create a dedicated uh, monitoring MRS and use this MRS as the monitoring MRS. So we'll have it uh, demo uh, to show where the monitoring configuration can be performed in the admin console. So we can configure uh, monitoring for uh, showing the monitoring statistics as well as for the reports and the statistics view. Let's go on to the demo. To configure monitoring configuration, log in to admin console, click on the domain and then click on the monitoring configurations. Get an option to choose the model repository service, credentials and the number of uh, preserved days for storing the statistics about the uh, jobs. You can click on edit uh, here to model repository service where you want to store the monitoring statistics you can provide the credentials as well as you can update or reduce the number of uh, preserve uh, days for storing the summary historical data and detailed historical data and also you can choose the number um, how frequently you want to purge the statistics and at what time let's talk about how to access monitoring tool Configuring the model repository service as you were monitoring uh, MRS and provide the other configuration, you have to restart the data integration service so that it picks up the newly configured model repository service. So we'll talk about how we can access this monitoring tool in a different ways. We can access the Informatica monitoring tool from the admin console. We have to provide HTTP or HTTPS whichever is configured. Admin console host port number slash monitoring. So here I have provided admin console host, port number slash monitoring and it has taken me to the monitoring uh, tool. We can also monitor the object on the job status tab in the analyst tool. This job status tab stores the status of the analyst tool job such as profile jobs, scorecard jobs as well as the mapping specification results. Log in to analyst tool, click on the manage tab and job status. So here we can view the statistics of the jobs, similar to monitoring tool from the admin console. In the analyst tool, click on the manage and job status. Here we can view the status of the jobs. This tool lists out the job statistics of the jobs type, preview, mapping, etc. Only. Let's see how we can access this monitoring tool from the developer tool. From the developer tool, I have connected to a um, model repository service and I have submitted the job. Go to the process tab and then click on this option and uh, select data monitor the uh, jobs. So when prompted, select the data integration service you have used. It will take you to the same uh, monitoring tab tool. Monitoring tool, login. We can view the job statistics. 
in the browser so let's talk about uh, monitoring tool features so in the monitoring tool you can view the job statistics of an ad hoc job applications like uh, logical data objects sql data service objects web service request workflows and the deployed mappings so here i am going to the data integration service called dis 102 test click on the ad hoc jobs i can see all the ad hoc job statistics here I have an application, I have expanded it and then I click on the workflows to view the statistics of the workflows which is available in this application. So let's talk about the summary statistics and execution statistics tab of the monitoring tool. Summary statistics page uh, shows you the graphical representation of the job executed by the data integration service in the domain. You can configure it to view by data integration service. So we can also view the tabular or grid view of the jobs executed by this data integration service. We can view ad hoc job, data deployed mappings and workflow details. Let's directly see it in the monitoring tool. Under summary statistics in the monitoring tool, click on the data integration service, view statistics. I can see the list of uh, ad hoc jobs in the gra graphical representation, deployed mappings, request and the connections for the web services as well as the resource usage. So we can also view the tabular form by clicking on this option. Execution statistics uh, tab displays the data integration services available in the domain as well as the jobs executed uh, by these data integration service. We can view the job statistics uh, in this execution statistics page. Uh, go to execution statistics, expand the data integration service, click on the adopt jobs to view the job statistics of the adopt jobs. You can select the job, you can select to view the uh, logs as well as the statistics. Similarly, you can view the workflows, uh, job statistics expand it and see the result as well as you can get the logs so let's talk about the reports and the statistics uh, settings available in the monitoring tool under execution statistics click on the domain go to actions report and statistics settings here you can choose uh, what information or what is update frequency you want to view under the statistics and what are the reports to be available under the bis reports tab so you can select the reports you want to like uh, add or remove you can choose to like remove the uh, rep uh, report which is already added to the reports tab or you can add a uh, new report okay. go to data integration service reports tab and uh, choose the number of uh, uh, duration you want to view the uh, reports here i'm selecting the last one day i can view the uh, statistics so add up jobs etc so we have done with the monitoring configuration let's talk about uh, why monitoring tool hangs list of uh, scenarios uh, where we have identified a uh, monitoring tool hangs for example when the monitoring mrs which is configured to show the monitoring statistics when it gets hanged the monitoring tool hangs when the data integration service which update the statistics about the job to the monitoring mrs is hung the monitoring tool hangs. The database load or the performance side of the database also impacts the monitoring tool. Outdated indexes from the database side. Also the load on the node on the informatica system can cause the monitoring tool to hang. Since there are various scenarios for the monitoring tool to hang, it is important to collect these diagnostics to identify what caused this problem. The state uh, issues, what is exactly causing the monitoring and tool hang scenarios? There are so many scenarios that can cause monitoring tool to hang. It is important to collect the right diagnostics to identify what causes monitoring tool hung issues. The performance related issues while accessing the monitoring tool, we have to collect the JSTAC or InfraDump, TOP, SAR output, or post GC logs. We can choose to collect the JSTAC on uh, processes like data integration service, model repository service, node process, and admin console processes we can collect jstack with a time gap of uh, two to three minutes for about five times so uh, we can also collect a spy log on monitoring mrs this is to identify whether the database update is happening on the monitoring mrs we can also collect a database reports to understand the performance 
of the queries executed by the model repository server. Collect uh, domain log, MRS log, JSF logs of the MRS as and in total info logs to understand if there are any issues with the MRS itself. Let's talk about a few of the cases where we have troubleshooted the monitoring issues. Have picked up a couple of KB article. Let's talk about uh, these articles. The data integration hangs during the startup. Let's discuss these two cases. So in this KB article, we have talked about data integration service taking very long time to come up. So this article talks about data integration service taking very long time to come up with a below warning message stating connectivity to the monitoring stat MRS is lost. So they also noticed that the monitoring MRS uh, was disabled then the data integration comes up without any delay. So uh, this article talks uh, about the integration service communicates to the monitoring MRS during the startup process to get the list of application and the workflow recovery information. So in this case data integration service was unable to fetch the stats from the monitoring MRS for a long time. This caused the data integration service to take a longer time for the startup. So this happened only on the SQL server when this issue was reported. So we have uh, reported this issue with our R&D team. We got a uh, below suggestion which uh, fixed this issue. We requested the uh, user to create uh, indexes on the uh, tables like PR attributes and uh, PRG annotation as well as we requested to set the isolation level we committed uh, snapshot on on the SQL Server database. So which helped to uh, resolve this issue. So let's talk about the another case in a so in this KB article we are talking about Diaz going into hung state during the startup. So this article talks about uh, how we took the JSTAC and uh, analyzed the JSTAC traces to identify the exact problem. This JSTAC was collected on data integration service where we can see that uh, data integration service has made a request to monitoring service to get the folders and that is when it is being waiting on for a longer time. The cause of this problem was identi identified to be a single MRS which was configured as a monitoring MRS for storing both the monitoring statistics as well as the DQ objects. So you also notice that uh, after disabling the separate schema was configured as a monitoring MRS for dedicatedly as a monitoring MRS after which data integration service came up successfully. So it is always recommended to create a separate MRS for monitoring purpose to avoid any kind of hang or performance issues. After disabling the DI, a separate schema was configured for monitoring MRS after which DS came up successfully. So let's talk about a few monitoring tab hang issues. So in this article, we talk about monitoring tab hang while opening from the admin console. The problem is when we try to access the monitoring tab, it doesn't open completely and it says uh, keep loading content. Even after clearing the monitoring uh, deployed folders from the server machine and restarting the admin console process, issue persists. We noticed another issue where data integration service cannot list the application deployed on it when clicked on the data integration and application tab. So in this case, we have collected a JSTAC on data integration service to identify why data integration service is not listing the application. So in this uh, stack, we could see that list application call is hanging. So uh, basically, it has made a request to model repository service to get the all the application, and then it is trying to list the application names. So we notice this particular thread is blocked. We also notice there are many such blocked threads in the DIS JSTACs. So we collected the uh, JSTAC on the MRS to understand why MRS is not responding to the get application uh, list request. MRS uh, JSTAC, we found a block thread which is in turn waiting on the indexes. So the engine failed not if not running. We can get the location of the index file where MRS is storing the indexes. After disabling the MRS, we have removed this uh, index files and we restarted the model repository service which recreated the indexes to resolve this issue. So let's talk about the IT space usage in the database uh, server. So this article talks about uh, the space used by database where the monitoring MRS data is stored is larger, uh, uh, gets larger each day. 
below tables and indexes were growing so uh, the cause of the problem found to be the preserve uh, summary historical data and the detailed historical data configured in the monitoring level it was set to an higher number of days the recommended is to uh, reduce it to like less than 5 so that the workload on the database is get reduced which in turn is the performance of the database and the monitoring tool uh, we have an auto library on tuning the performance of the monitoring model repository so this article talks about the configuring the post statistics and uh, tuning the model repository service this article talks about uh, reducing the preserved number of historical data and the detailed historical data to improve the performance. Tune the monitoring model repository, increase the maximum heap size, JSTAG, memory settings, etc. So we can increase the uh, maximum heap size of the uh, model repository service in the admin console and other properties in the admin console, which will improve the performance of the monitoring MRS. So we talked about uh, the recommendation already. So uh, never keep the same MRS for storing the monitoring stats and the design time object. Create a new MRS and use it as a monitoring MRS. Reduce the number of days configured in the admin console to preserve the monitoring statistics for the monitoring MRS. Recommended is 5 days. So there are few known performance issues on the SQL Server. Try to avoid keeping the SQL Server as your uh, monitoring MRS database. Um, if you had to keep the SQL Server, then ensure that allow snapshot uh, isolation is set to on. It committed snapshot is set to on. You can use the purge monitoring data command to regularly purge the monitoring uh, statistics from the MRS. Refer to this document for more uh, performance uh, tuning uh, details. As we see in a uh, couple of KB articles, uh, we suggest uh, recommending the clusters on the tables which are storing a uh, large number of data on the database level as well as create statistics and update statistics with the full scan to improve the performance of the uh, query on the database side. We have few known issues around the monitoring. We have seen high CPU utilization on the database side especially when SQL Server is used. In the number of days uh, and tuning the model repository service uh, should help in overcoming this issue. As said, uh, SQL Server is not recommended, but uh, if you are keeping SQL Server for a monitoring MRS, there, are, there is a KB article which talks about DB side tuning. We have seen double logging issues when the user tries to log into the admin console. It prompts the user for providing the credential uh, twice. So you can refer to this article for cleaning up the Tomcat uh, folders. Verify the user myths. Also, we have another KB article which talks about uh, double lock in when HTTPS is enabled for admin console, which is due to an uh, older uh, algorithm used uh, while creating the key store. So, recommended is uh, SHA 256 with the uh, RSA. So, we also have a few known issues with double logging and monitoring MRS uh, statistics are not purged in certain cases. Even after following the uh, Ebo, uh, KB article recommendation, if uh, admin console is prompting for double login, you can contact support team and verify if we have an uh, EBO. Also on the database side, if the monitoring MRS is storing a uh, very large amount of data, even purge is not working, it is, not suppo it is supposed to purge the data on a regular interval on a regular uh, number of days configured but if it is not reducing the uh, data size on the database side uh, contact support team because we have a known issues where the monitoring MRS statistics are not purged we can evaluate if you are uh, facing that problem optimizing the monitoring MRS performance create a model repository service that is dedicated to store the monitoring uh, data Ensure that uh, you have uh, followed all the tuning uh, guidelines. Reduce the number of days uh, configured for storing the statistics. Increase the monitoring MRS heap size. Update the statistics and indexes. So here I have given uh, references uh, to the few of the articles we have talked about. Uh, tuning performance for the model repository service. Data integration service uh, hang issue during the startup. Monitoring tab hang issues as well as the disk uh, space uh, usage on the database uh, server you can go to this article and uh, check the JSTACs by with your environment JSTAC and see if it is matches with any of the cases described here we would love to hear from you if there are any feedback please provide to support videos at informatica.com as well as you can update us on twitter.com slash infrasupport thank you